So today I decided to throw on my high-vis vest and do a little bit of construction work, you know? No, but for real though, I'm not really sure how much construction's gonna be going on, but I've got myself a forklift. And I will let you know that we are definitely going to be having a lot of fun with this forklift. On the front of this forklift, it has a little sticker that says, Caution, do not touch or you will die. Well, we do not listen to stickers. Now, if you've never seen a forklift before, and you've just completely been living under a rock for your entire life, this is what a forklift can do, okay? We can go up and we can go down. Now, I'm hoping that we can pick up people's cars with this. I know, obviously, we're not going to be able to pick up trucks and stuff, but you know, if we see like a motorcycle or a little smart car drive around, maybe we can pick them up and that's just gonna be a ton of fun. So before I go around with this forklift, I kind of wanna test what it's fully capable of. Like I said, I know we're not gonna be able to pick up a van or anything, but maybe like with motorcycles. Oh, there we go. I've kind of gotta scoop it up. There we go, now if I lift it up. Oh, okay, damn it, we messed it up. However, you guys can see where I'm going with this. So let me just try that again properly. Stop sliding off. Stop it. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. A little bit more. What are you doing? Do you want to know what this forklift reminds me of? Have you guys ever been at an arcade where you play those um, games? What is it called? You know the one with the... Where you have like loads of teddy bears and there's like a hand and you've got a joystick and you've kind of got to aim where the hand goes to pick up a teddy bear? That's kind of what this reminds me of. By the way, I've only won a teddy bear from one of those things once in my life. It is the biggest scam ever, I'm telling you. Are you guys ready to see what a construction worker does in his spare time? Here we go. Oh, oh, come on. One of them, there we go. <laughs> Would anybody like a cactus? I know there's people out there that call it cacti. I'm not calling it cacti. Right, I have to try that again. Here we go. No, 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 no. Damn it. It's pretty hard because you kind of have to slot yourself in carefully. But then you've also got to pick the cactus up carefully too, just so it doesn't break. Here we go, we're going to try it again. Up, 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 up. There we go, there we go. <laughs> now that is what I'm talking about. Yeah, look how big this cactus is. What the hell? Now I can actually say that I've had a cactus before. Obviously not one this size, but you can buy like little cactuses in pots. And I will never forget the day where I had it in my kitchen and it was right next to one of my drawers where I keep like the forks, knives, spoons and stuff. And I go to open this drawer and boom, my elbow hits the spiky cactus. And my God, do not try this. Just take my word for it. It goddamn hurts. And that was on a small one. So I can't imagine what bumping your elbow on something this size would feel like. Can we carry it though? Come on, I want to try and carry it, but it's just too big. Come on. No, 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 no. It's falling. Oh, no, we're wheel spinning. Really? I'm not going anywhere? No! So I was heading down to the city and I spotted these other two construction workers. Hey, how's it going? This guy's smoking a cigarette. Doesn't look like he's doing too much work to me. And this guy is just pretending that he's hammering something. Let's test out what damage a forklift can do ramming into two people. Oh, that looked painful. Oh, that really looked painful. Oh, yeah, that one is definitely dead. Can you spare something? Can you spare something? Let me see what I can spare. Hmm, his sign says, bet you can't hit me with a quarter. Nice one. I bet everybody's going to be trying to hit you with a quarter. These guys are asking me for cash, yet they've got money to buy cigarettes. That is not how it works, I'm afraid. Hello there. Can I interest you in having anything lifted? I'm good, thank you though, man. Come on, listen, I know there's gotta be something. Oh, this ain't even my house, I'm just sitting here. I know, but I can still pick something up for you. Go pick the cop car up down there. Listen, I can't pick up a cop car. Hey, you said anything, so I'm telling you. No, you something you need picked up. Yeah, I do need that cop car picked up. And why is that? Because the pig is in my way. The pig is in your way. Well, why don't you just make a bacon sandwich nope. then? I'd have to kill a cop and I want to kill a cop. Well, you're the one talking about pigs in your way. Well, I gotta go, man. You have a good day. You ain't gotta go nowhere. Damn it, I'm just trying to do business. He is definitely up to something illegal though. He wanted me to pick up that cop car down there for some reason. I mean, I wish I could, but this forklift isn't strong enough. Oh, this guy's got a big truck. Ooh, he's got a high-vis vest on too. Hey man, how's it going? Nice truck you got. Ah, uh, thank you, buddy. You into some construction too, I guess? Uh, yeah. I mean, this is just to help with uh, hooking up the vehicles. 
because uh, sometimes you get vehicles, not like this one, this one's pretty pristine. Sometimes you get vehicles that are missing wheels, you know. It helps to be able to just fix them up a little before you uh, pop them on the back of the flatbed over there. Dude, this is a really nice one. I believe this belongs to a, uh, a cop or a sheriff of some kind. Really? Pull it in. It's a nice vehicle for a in. cop. Oh yeah, he had it parked on a red, you know. It's hardly you ever find a uh, cop car, you know. Yeah. When you're able to nab one of these, hoo-hoo, you can give him some shit down at the DP. If I found this, I would take it home for myself. Would you get in trouble if you done that? Oh yeah, you'll get in a lot of trouble if you take one of these bad boys. If he doesn't collect it, I get to crush this thing, so... You're gonna crush me. this if he doesn't come and collect it. Look, I'll take it. Oh yeah. And Don't I'm need to crush this. It. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a enjoy watching this thing pop. Is that what you got the headphones on for? Noise cancelling, so I don't have to hear the whining of people as I take the car away. I guess they come in handy then, right? Well, I'm just driving this, look. Yeah, this is what I'm working with. Is that thing even street legal? I don't know, but I've been driving it around. Oh, there's an entrance this way too, okay. Right, I've got to test something out, okay? Down a little bit. And I doubt you'll be able to lift this bad boy. Just yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, damn it, it doesn't even go up. I mean, you lifted my suspension a little bit, but I'd say the spring is what helping you there. Yeah, I mean, I've been hearing that these uh, these new forklifts they've got going around the place have, like, no lifting power whatsoever. Is that why I can't lift anything? Yeah, I mean, I remember when I used to use these things, man. You'd go to pick up a pallet with some crates on it or something, the thing wouldn't even budge. And these things have, like, zero lifting power. We ended up getting a uh, dozer to come do the job. Oh, Those man. Get overkill. Yeah, I, I need a dozer right now. But, um, don't know where I can oh, find yeah. one. You'll have to run by some sort of construction site, see if you can get your hands on one. No one mate Elijah usually, uh, usually rents one out for his farm down in, uh, Grapeseed. Oh, nice. Okay. I'm gonna end up, uh, gonna have to call this in at some point. Make sure they know it's in the impound. Otherwise, that cop's gonna be confused as to where his vehicle went. Yeah, what is this, a Camaro? Uh, looks like it, yeah. Man, I wouldn't mind one of these in real life, though. Alright, well, I've gotta get back to work. It was nice talking to you. Alrighty, you too, man. Listen, if you need a new nice high-vis day. vest, I can hook you up with one. That one looks a little bit muddy. Uh, it is, but it's got character to it, you know? I've had true, it for a while. True, true. It's got its history. Okay, alright. Alrighty, you have a nice day, my man. You too. There's someone up there in a bush with a sniper, and he's shooting at me. Look, if he really wants to go that route, I will pull out the Draco. Hey, what you doing up there? We're playing airsoft. So why are you shooting me for? You know, I, I like shooting people. Oh, okay. Apparently they're playing airsoft. And then he just shoots at Hands me. Hands up. Hands up. This is a kidnapping. Hands up. Your friend just told me that these are airsoft guns, so I'm not scared. One bit. <laughs> oh, he found Let's me. go. I'm booking it. Oh. Come here, boy. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> One of your friends just died. Guys, look behind me right now. We got three people chasing me. What do you want from me? I'm a construction worker. What are you gonna take? My high vis jacket? I'm taking your virginity. We're take Come your here, boy. That's not happening today. Right, listen to me, guys. You are gonna be in big trouble if you try anything. Oh, right here. Oh, yeah. right. this man is go. Ow! Oh, 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 I'm gonna oh. shoot you next. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa, come on, bro. Is that god mode? Or is that a really strong no. bulletproof vest? Oh, okay. Now listen to me. You're not gonna try anything. Oh, your friend's up there, huh? Oh! God damn it, there was too many of them. Okay, so right now I'm outside of the police department, and they have these funny looking cars. I've never seen a police vehicle like this. What even is this? I must say it's pretty cool. It's like an upgraded golf cart. Now I was kind of wondering if we could- Oh, did I just trip over my own forklift? You didn't see that. Yeah, I was kind of wondering if we could actually pick up this car. Since it is pretty small, let's have a go. I don't think we will be able to though. Come on. Oh, we're moving it. No, it's just too heavy. God damn it, this forklift can't lift up anything. They've got a bunch of them in the parking lot. You know what? If one day I become a cop, that is the vehicle that I want to be driving. So I think this guy is away from his keyboard, right? But he has left his GTR unattended over here. So, hey man, how you doing? You want me to pick you up? Come on. I know you want it. No, I'm fine. You want it. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> this guy's Paul McLaren is destroyed. I'm gonna see if I can push it off the edge in time. Let me put this thing all the way down. There we go. We're pushing it. Hey, what are you doing? Get out of here. You're gonna get yourself shot. I'm gonna get myself shot. I'm just trying get to get out of here. Out. Leave. No, take your Fort Lift and go. All right, I need to put some gas in the back. 
Hold up. Once I get gases and I want to see you in that forklift and going. Sure thing, man. Wait. Oh, baby. What was you saying? That's what I thought. And now I'm going to try and push this off the edge. Come on. Just a little bit more. I reckon two more hits. What do you guys say? Ready? Here we go. One more. <sighs> Here we go. Final hit. It's going over the edge. Oh. There we go. That guy's Paul McLaren is now history. I'm gonna honk my horn until these cops say something. Can you not honk here? Why not? Because this is the police department, we're all getting set up and stuff, and it is very annoying. What do you mean set up? This is the police department, you're illegally parking your forklifts right now, and you need to leave. I'm here to do my job, sir. I did not What's choose to be here. Well, you guys requested me to pick up this mailbox. Yeah, yeah I know no, we didn't. That. Yes, you did. All right, and who signed the papers? I, I wouldn't know that. That's your job, not mine. I'm just here to do my job, you know? Well, you should have all the paperwork with you if you're here to lift it up. Absolutely not. That is at my office, and you should have a copy okay, too. Okay, well then you do not have permission to be here right now. And do you even have papers to be driving this on the, on the street? Listen, sir, there's no need to be hostile towards me. I'm here to do my job, oh. you're here to do your job. Okay, okay well, if you don't you have require proof, paperwork. Uh, I I'm doing my job. You, you guys have the copy to too. To Out my way, you're obstructing me from working. That's my no, job. No, no. Not on government property. Should I'm you guys sorry. not be like catching criminals or something? Shouldn't you be doing something else instead of trying to pick shit up at the police station? Well, you guys wanted it picked up. Uh, if we wanted it to get picked up, uh, it would have got called in. Go and check the papers. You guys have a copy. Out of my way or I'm going to have to use brutal force. And I don't want to have to do that because it's raining. I'm getting a little bit cold you right now. Brutal force. I'm going to use brutal force. So how about you just uh, step your You know what I'm going to do over back. here? Step off the forklift now or you're going to get oh, tased. My. You guys, I don't know who it was. One of you requested. Um, did Probably that a forklift one. to come and pick the mailbox up. So I'm right here there. to do that, and now you're moaning. I'm no one's the moaning. Uh, what are you I'm doing, the only sir? One that's gonna be moaning is you when he shoves that baton up your ass. So are you gonna answer me? And you're gonna leave 70... his premises. What the hell? Um, you might want to sort that out. Okay, there's some mm. chaos going on outside of the police department, and I think they're distracted, so I kind of just backed up. I thought when he told me to get out of the forklift that he was going to give me a ticket, but then one of those cop cars flipped, and I think they got distracted. Look what I managed to get. I got the mailbox. You know, I was only just doing my job, and the cops were trying to hassle me for it. Can we lift the mailbox up? Oh, we can. How amazing is the forklift? Thank you guys very much for watching today's video. If you did find yourself enjoying it, make sure you take the time to slap a like on it, as when I see a video with lots of likes, that lets me know that you guys are enjoying them. If you happen to be new around here, do consider hitting that subscribe button down below and turning post notifications on, as I upload videos here every single day that I definitely think you'd enjoy.